supernatural power and light came and butchered two trees at 42 Garden Avenue. Butchered two trees. That was Saturday at 2 a.m., October 20th. Notice, and I have copies of what I'm showing you, which I'm going to give you, but you'll notice when you look at them, most of the branches that were cut off and left on the property are from very low part of the tree. This is, this is typical. I, saw, I picked this up today at 3 o'clock because all of the dead branches were left there by Jersey Central. This is typical. Uh, when I learned about this, I went over there at 11 o'clock on Thursday morning, and uh, I mean Saturday morning. I went over at 11 o'clock on Saturday morning, and I looked at this. These two beautiful trees on private property were, were butchered. This shows you an angle of this where you can see how these trees were sliced on private property and this mess was left here. And it was still there at 3 o'clock today. Um, as I said, I have copies of this for each one of you. And this nonsense, I call nonsense, that Jersey Central Power and Light does has to stop. They aren't even a New Jersey company. They're from Ohio. I tried to call them this morning on their 800th number. And the first person that answered was in West Virginia. And when I said what I wanted to talk to someone, they said, oh, I'll transfer you. They transferred me to somebody in Pennsylvania. I said, can I talk to anybody that is uh, Jersey Central Power and Light? Well, couldn't. So I drove to Marstown to the headquarters. And I went in, and the gentleman there, very nice guy, he had on his first energy jacket. And uh, so I, was t I was talking about a number of things. He was pleasant. He said, send me what you want to know, and I'll get back to you. But I think that we need, we, you, and we representatives in the, in, in the, in the community should do something about this. We should stop this. They, they just, they're just ruining our trees. They don't listen. I know, Mayor, a couple years ago you asked them how much to put the wires underground on Main Street. They said, oh, millions of dollars. And when I went back and asked the same gentleman you asked, he said, I said, can you tell me how many millions for Main Street and how many blocks? He said, oh, that would take a lot of work. So we don't, got, we don't have that answer. So that's what I wanted to show you. And this was, these were two absolutely beautiful trees on, on, on this person's property.